and welcome back to End of Earth. Now, last time left off, I was going on the moon to get ourselves some more of those meteorites or meteors or whatever they're called. And I, I, I didn't get too many of them. I got a pretty good amount of them. Let's just uh, go to the moon real quick. F-A-B-0-A-C-K-A-3. But I, I, I got a pretty good amount of them. I got uh, 14 of them and I, I got like two more of them as well. And I've already put them in the furnace, so they're probably already done. Uh, yeah, there's two more right there, so we're up to 16. I don't know exactly how many we need. I think I think it was like 18 or something, maybe a little bit more than that for the tier 2 rocket. And uh, we're going to basically remake all the parts to make the tier 3. Actually, I think we can make the tier 4 rocket right away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, if we make the tier 4 rocket right away, we, we could definitely do that because we don't need to go to the asteroids or to the asteroid belt to get... Uh, titanium. We can go there for fun, you know, go around, explore a bit, because I've never been there before, but uh, we don't have to go there and actually explore and get some stuff, so what I did was I, I sat around for a little while, and then I realized that's stupid, and then I set up these uh, these chunk loaders, so I had like three extra chunk loaders just sitting in my chests, and uh, because I wasn't using them, because I took them away from the four corners of our our earth map because we I didn't want any more grass to grow and uh, it caused a little bit of extra lag that I didn't really need and I put another chunk loader over here here's another chunk loader over here and then there's another one over there and uh, they've been you know loading in chunks letting the meteors fall while uh, on the moon and stuff so that's how I've gotten a pretty good amount of these meteors not like a pretty I'm not, I don't know it, it's, it's a pretty decent amount like we almost have enough to get the full tier 2 rocket and I also found out that uh, we can teleport right back home using the mechanism teleporter, and it doesn't glitch out. I guess it only glitches out whenever you're on uh, in the end or something like that. I don't know, but apparently that's the only time it ever glitches out. I also repaired the Paxel and named it Dapaxel because why not? It was almost broken, so I actually had to repair it. And I thought, why not just rename it while I'm at it? So <laughs> there we go. So let's actually see what do we need. Uh, let's just throw all those into the furnaces for right now. What do we exactly need for the tier four? Tier four. Rocketaroo. So tier four heavy duty plates, of course, combine that with the tier three. And the heavy duty is uh compressed titanium. So we have a lot of titanium inside of here. And we got those from getting bone meal from the bones, just throwing bones into here. They go into the sag mill, and we get like six bone meal per per bone, I think. So that was, that was pretty cool. We put it into the chemical decomposer, and uh the bone meal turns into like titanium and uh what's the other one? Silicon maybe? Titanium and silicon? I don't remember for sure. I'm not, I don't remember for sure, but we did get a ton of titanium and we synthesized a bunch of ingots, so there we go. Let's just throw these into the compressoru and uh, wait, what are these? Well, that was glitched out titanium mine ingots right there. That was weird. Let's just let those uh, compress down for now and uh, let's look at the tier 4 rocket once more. So since we're skipping tier 3, we can definitely save a little bit of extra materials. So, uh, by the way, tier 4 rockets can go pretty much anywhere, like tier 1, tier 2, tier 3, and of course tier 4. So, it's not like we're going to be missing out on anywhere. We can still go to Venus, and I think, I think tier 4, let's check. I think tier 4 is also Mercury, is it also Pluto? Tier 4 is also Mercury, is Pluto tier 5? <gasps> yep, tier, tier 5 uh, Pluto, so, ooh, I don't know, what do you need for tier 5? Is it uh, mercurium or some other some other thing? Compressed quantonium. I think you get that from Venus or frosnium. What frosnium? Is that from some ice planet? If that's from some ice planet, and we need to go to the to Pluto, that means we need to go to a different solar system, most likely. I'm pretty sure because we can't go to the, any any of the gas giants, of course. And Mercury is, you know, hot. Venus is hot as well. Mars is the only, like, cold, terrestrial place I can think of, you know? And, I, I, of course, asteroids as well. So, I guess maybe we have to go to a different solar system. I don't know which one. This one right here? Cap- Capitan? Let's see, what is this? Oh, man, it's, like, glitched out. Let's go to this solar system. What is this one? Sirius? We can go to Sirius. Let's go over here to Sirius. And let's check out their planets. Diona, tier 4. Okay, okay, that's pretty cool. Polonius, that's tier 5. What's this one? Tier... Tier 6, but for Nibiru. And Fronos is tier 7. And I think there's a tier 8 planet right there, right next to the star. Sirius B, you kidding me? You kidding me? I don't know how we're going to... Oh, man. It's going to take a lot of stuff. What's this one? That's just a lone planet over there. Cap Captain B, tier 7. 
I hope, I hope at least one of these are habitable, you know? So we can go to Diona, and that's tier 4. We can go with the rocket that we're making right now. And hopefully Diona has... Wait, wasn't one of the materials named, like, Diondium or something? No, Quantonium. Okay. Okay, well, I must have been thinking of something else then. Okay, well, I guess, yeah. I guess we could just skip to tier 4. Then this is tier 5, so, yeah. This one's Titanium for, we need for this one, so. Yeah, I guess we have to go to, like, Dion Diandia or whatever that other planet was called. What was it? Di Didondia? Something like that? Diona, okay. That's pretty cool. Anyways, our titanium is... How's that doing? How's our titanium going? Is it all the... Oh, oh, 17 and 17 up to 34 now. Nice. That should be enough to get the whole entire rocket, right? I'm pretty sure. All right. Uh, other than that, I also worked on the uh, the fusion chamber over here. I finally set up this thing. Oh, wait, what? Bromine? Why did it make bromine? 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 I don't know why it made that, but I put aluminum inside of here, and then it fuses together and then outputs into here so i'd actually like set up a hopper underneath the fusion chamber and you know conduit it up to this chest so that's how we have this so let's just grab all of the iron in here all the fe and oh there's another stack of roux let's go throw those into the chemical what is this thing chemical synthesis machine let's go throw those into here i think you need like a 16 stack on each thing to make the actual block of iron right or is it a 64 stack Maybe it is a 64 stack. I don't know. Let's see usages for this. Uh, synthesis machine. What's the uh, block? Oh, yeah, it is 16 for each one. I mean, I, I thought I put 16 for each one. I guess not. Oh, there's a... Yep, there's a few there. Oh, man, these... God, these ones in the middle. I don't know why. There we go. Come on. There we go. Got them. God. Three more of them. God, I have to fix it. Oh, there we go. There we go. And there we go. Okay, iron blocks. Fantastic. So let's throw some iron up into there. There we go. And some more iron blocks. Delicious. Oh, man, we're finally getting a pretty decent amount of iron. 28,000 RF for each iron block, though. Ooh, that's expensive power-wise, you know? Ah, oh, man, I need to upgrade these conduits so they... They transfer power a lot faster if I want to get a lot of iron blocks this way, but definitely saves a lot more time than just, you know, going out and mining and stuff. It, it takes use of all of our extra materials we have in all these diamond chests over here that are just sitting around doing nothing. I also want to make the uh, the fission chamber as well, because we have a lot of pretty pretty high-numbered stuff up here, like lead. That's 82. We can, we can break that down into something, you know, a lot more useful for us. There we go. Come on, some more iron. Got... Ah... Uh, more iron blocks, throw the rest of our iron into there, alright. So we have six iron blocks, that's a really, really good amount. Let's, uh, let's turn those all into... Do we have any coal? <laughs> we barely have any coal. So what do you need? How much, how much carbon do you need for one coal? Was that like eight or something? I think you do, yeah. So let's go to... There it is, I passed it. Yep, eight carbon for that, so... We have a pretty decent amount of carbon. We might be able to make a, a pretty good amount of coal as well, so... Let's grab all of that. And let's see. If we get, what, eight? Eight carbon? Yep, there you go. So we put that up there. Should be able to get some... Some coal. And we can use that to make the steel plates that we're going to need for the rocket, of course. So there you go, some more coal. And... There you go, yeah, yeah, pretty good amount. Almost two stacks of coal right there, really, really good. Uh, so I need to make these into actual iron plates. And I'll just split those in half, like so. And... There we go. These can be split into iron plates, and then over here is where- oh, that's the titanium. Okay, and then over here I put the coal, and that's where we'll put the iron, and we'll get a pretty good amount, so. There we go. Uh, did I grab all of the coal that I can? I think I did. Alright. So put up all the FE back up in there, and spread this back out so we can grab ourselves iron blocks whenever we please. There we go, nice. There we go. Can we grab another? Yeah, we can grab another one real quick. Might as well, right? Uh, let's put up all this extra garbage we're not going to be using. So, there we go. Silicon. A little bit of that garbage. So, there we go. Pretty good amount of stuff right now. Up to 30 more titanium. Uh, compressed titanium. Pretty, really, really, really good, actually. Really good. So, let's compress these back down into, like, so. And five and five and five and five. Alright, so we're going to get a pretty good amount of steel there. Uh, oh yeah, how is our meteor doing? Nine there, didn't I have a... And seven there, sixteen. Huh, do we have any, like, meteor ingots already? Yeah, we have two meteor ingots in there now. 
Do we have any... We're up to 18, though, so that's good. So if we go can put this into here, we should be able to get the... Or does it just need one? Yeah, it just needs one, okay. So we put that into there for now. Uh, Heavy-duty plates, you're gonna need... Dash. Okay, so we need to go grab the dash. Where's the dash? It must be in here, because I think we threw it in before it went to the moon. So, yep, there's the dash ingots, and dash ingots, alright. So, iron here is almost done, iron here is done, so... Compress these down into dash ingots. Okay, you just used one right there, like last time, okay. So, yeah, 12 more right there. God, we're getting a pretty good amount of steel, not gonna joke. <laughs> if only we could break down that rocket, you know, salvage its parts. Can we? We might- I don't know, let's see if there's like a machine. Galactic craft. Craft, I don't know, there might be a machine that you can salvage this- the parts for. You know, cause that would- that would save a lot of time and money on our car insurance, so. If we can like salvage the parts, we can just upgrade the new thing, like right now we just need to add dash and titanium. And we won't need to get more parts, we just upgrade all the uh, all the existing parts, you know? I'm not seeing anything here. Orion Drive? What? Astro Miner? <gasps> oh yeah, someone said I should make something called a Digital mine Miner. Digital Miner. This thing, what is this? Ooh, that looks expensive. Maybe it's- Oh, it just looks expensive, but it's not really that expensive. It ju it's just- Oh, it's teleportation course. We're going to need more of those. Are you kidding me? <sighs> I don't know. Ro robit? Was that Robit or Robit? What is that thing? I don't know. I guess it's a robot. So it's got an energy tablet, atomic alloy, electric chest, and steel. And the electric chest is, you know, it's, you know, it's pretty cheap. Decently cheap. I guess if we put our time towards it, we can make ourselves a, a digital miner. So what is the description for this thing? A highly advanced filter-based auto miner. Ooh! That can mine whatever block you tell it to within a 32 block radius. Wow, that's... A th whatever block I tell it to, so I can tell it to mine stone, and it can quarry out a pretty good amount of 32 block radius. So that means 64 block diameter. So that's, whoa, that's, that's going to be really good. Maybe we should make that. Wow. Thanks whoever uh, suggested I make that. I, d I did not know that thing like existed, like, holy butts. That's really good. Let's check up on our stuff now. Compressed dash, we got a pretty good amount of there. Uh, if we can make one more. A uh, steel ingot thing. So what? what is this? Oh, that's the compressed meteoric stuff. And this is the steel, so... Uh, we're out of... Coal, or we're out of... Yeah, we're out of coal, so there we go. Let's go and get our last bit of steel. And we need to combine the meteoric iron with the... Oh yeah, we need to go grab a bunch of... Uh, this stuff, like compressed bronze and... What is the other one? Tin or aluminum? What is the other one? Tin or aluminum? I don't know. To make the actual, uh, these things. Uh, recipe for that. Recipe, uh, aluminum. Okay, glad it's aluminum, because we have a ton. We just need to get rid of it, you know? Let's grab half a stack of blocks, break those down, and let the, uh, let the compressor just do its thing, you know? Uh, there we go. And that should be good, so let's go do the same thing with bronze, and in the meantime, while that's all cooking, uh, do we have bronze, uh, blocks in here? I thought we did. Copper block. Yeah, there we go. Block of bronze. Let's break those down. And while that's working, we can get our uh, digital miner uh, start crafting that. So there we go. That's all cooking there. Let's grab, uh, let's put all that machine parts actually. You know what? I'm putting all that stuff in the wrong chest. <laughs> whatever, whatever. They're all parts to a machine anyway, so it's all, it's all going in the same place. There we go. Putting all the stuff we don't really need up into there. And I'll just throw out all this garbage. You're not going to be using that anytime soon. There we go. Conduit binders? Ugh. Get rid of those. Alright, let's go back to that digital miner. See what we need to make that. So we need atomic alloys, so reinforced alloy, and then we need these. Do we have any energetic alloys already in here? Oh, we already have some reinforced alloys. Uh, reinforced. Combine those with obsidian to make the refined alloys, I think. Is that what they're called? Atomic alloys. So do we have any of those? Uh, there you go. Alright. So we need to go combine those in the osmium or the metallurgic infuser. So there we go, two of those into there. And that should make the atomic thing. So there we go, we have those two covered. We go grab osmium and redstone, put those into the metallurgic infuser as well. So osmium. And where's the red? Oh, there you go, a little bit of redstone, not bad. And what else do we need? 
a logistical sorter. Oh, okay, yeah, <laughs> that sounds a lot more complicated than it really is. It's just a piston with some iron. So how's our how how's all of our I ooh, I think I yeah, I think I spent all of our iron on that stuff. But you know what? We might have Yeah, let's go grab some aluminum. Let's go throw that into the let's grab half a stack of blocks of these. There you go, yeah, there you go. Just do what you need to do. Grab all that aluminum. I'm gonna go throw that into the into the thing over there. What's that thing called? The fu the fusion chamber. Let's go throw all that into there, right? <laughs> Alright, so ooh, yeah, look at all this delicious aluminum. Delicious. Slurping up that aluminum. Where is it at? Oh, more aluminum there. Nice. Pretty good amount. Really good amount. There you go. Some more aluminum there. Nice. Alright. Oh, three more stacks. You kidding me? Oh, four more. Oh my god, this is a ton. We got a ton. This is... Oh, mid. Well, what is with all this lead? Why is this lead not, like, stacking? I don't know. Well, there you go. We have a ton of aluminum now. Let's just let the, uh, the fusion chamber do its thing. There we go, and is that is that making stuff? Yeah. Oh, I think it has to fill up to the other side, and then it'll start. Yep. There you go. Oh my God! I also re rewired these so it goes under these uh these what are they called again? I forgot what they're called, but it, it like hides it under these blocks, so it goes like this, and it powers into there, so it no longer has like a hole in the wall over here. So that's good. Anyways, uh, all those are still compressing down. What were we going to do? Oh yeah. We need to wait on this metallurgic infuser thing to finish, and I think it is now, so let's put the redstone in there. Osmium, like so. And we should have our atomic alloys in here, right? Yep, there you go, three atomic alloys. Let's throw, throw that into here for now. And we need to make the piston thing. Let's grab some iron, like so. And we need to make some pistons, so we need some iron, redstone, and uh, wood and cobblestone, I believe. So break a few blocks of redstone, and there you go. Grab some cobbleroo, and actually, that's that's pretty funny. That cobblestone is actually pretty scarce these days. I guess I have to manually, manually break some cobblestone right now. Ah oh, man, what a world we live in, where I have to manually break <laughs> cobblestone like that. Uh, I think I need like uh, I'm I'm, I'm going to break a few more of these. So there you go. Uh, let's, uh, let's make a cube of this, right? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. There you go, because I think we'll need, like, what, two or three more pistons, so... I'm going to need to make these anyways, so there you go. And let's just break them with the hammer. There you go. Alright, so we have a pretty good amount of pistons. Uh, we need to go get some wood as well, so... Eh, just planks. Eh, whatever. Whatever. So, planks. Let's put all those up there like that. Uh, cobblestone. I think it's like this, right? And... Is it redstone here? And then iron here? Or is it the other way? Oh, there you go. So let's get let's get three pistons, because I don't know exactly how many we need. So let's see, what's the other one? Uh, oh, okay. So we just get the pistons surrounded with iron and the base control circuit, which those base control circuits should be done. Yeah, there you go. Three and three, or two and three. I feel like we already have some in here, and we don't. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad. Uh, let's see, what do we need? Oh yeah, the base control circuit, like so. The piston. And the iron. There you go. So we can make both those logistical sorters. So those both sides of this are now done. So there you go. What what goes in the middle here? The robot thing. So that we need a base control circuit to go there as well. And steel casing. That's uh, iron or steel and osmium. Ooh. Let's grab some steel from this. We should have some. Yep. There you go. Four four there. And osmium. I think all the osmium is done because the. Metallurg the metallurgic infuser. Yeah, the metallurgic infuser ate it all, so <laughs> we need to make a- we need to break a block of osmium real quick. There we go. break a that. And we need to do this, I believe. And it should be done here. Yep, steel casing. Alright, so the steel casing is done as well. We just need to make the robot and the teleportation cores, which is even more atomic alloys. Are you kidding me? And uh, that was with, what, the obsidian? The obsidian dust, which you get from... I don't even know. I don't even know. Putting obsidian into the thing, maybe? Should have some obsidian here, right? Yeah, four obsidian. And the usages for that is... Yeah, you just put it into a grindstone. Is there a specific machine that gives us more obsidian? Uh, I don't think so. Dirty obsidian dust? I guess a enrichment chamber, maybe? 
C injection chamber. I just throw it into the enrichment chamber. So let's just do that. Osmium. Co oh, we already have some refined stuff inside here. So let's put the this into there. Atomic alloy. Uh, these into there. All right. So there we go. So the robot thing is pretty much covered now, or everything but the robot. I mean. So we need to make the atomic alloy, which we already have. Energy tablets, which is even more enriched alloy, some gold and some redstone, steel. An obsidian ingots and electric chest, which is another base control circuit. So maybe we should uh, not craft this one out just yet, just so we can auto craft some stuff here in the future. So there you go. Let's actually put this recipe on the screen. Robot, electric chest. So we need to make this. So that goes there. We need two chests. Actually, we need to make two chests real quick. So let's just do this. There we go. Two chests of ruse. Put those there. And put the little solar panel looking thing there, and we need one glass and two steel, or a little bit of steel. So let's grab some glass root, and there we go. And break a block of steel, right? Do we have any steel blocks? Oh, that's dark steel though. Yeah, there's steel right there. We need to make some more steel. We need some more. So we need that, that, and what was at the top of it? A glass, right? Yep, there you go, electric chest. Alright, so the robot is pretty close to being done. Uh, we just need two obsidian ingots to go on either side. There you go. And we already have the atomic alloy thing, so... And the base control circuit. What goes on the sides of it again? Energy tablets, which are pretty cheap stuff. Which is what? Osmium and redstone and... Or uh, redstone and iron for that, actually. Osmium, and we need four of those. And then we need some gold as well. We have some... I think we have a pretty decent amount of gold now, right? Uh, 15 blocks. Wow. Holy butts. I did not... Oh, yeah. That must have been because we went to the nether. <laughs> totally forgot about that. Whoops. Whoops.